Okay guys, what's good? How you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to Vinyl TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. I want to show you what we have here. We got this gear. This is HP Laserjet MFP M234DW printing gear. This printer is multifunctional printer. It's multi-tax, triple and one if you like. In the sense, you can copy, scan, and print from this gear. This printer is dual band. You can connect it via Wi-Fi network and USB cable connection. Right now, this printer is connected to Wi-Fi network. But I want to show you how to connect this via USB cable connection. We're going to connect this printer to with USB cable, okay? with this laptop but before we do that i want to give you an overview for this printer okay right now i'm going to turn this printer at the back this printer is built with your space in mind okay from the back here the power cable goes right here okay so the power cable goes in here okay and this button here this spot here is for a cable for your landline uh, for your telephone line goes right here okay this is for broadband and telephone line and this spot here is usb cable connection okay i want to mention unfortunately usb cable is not included with the packaging we have this alvinea tech store free delivery here in uk it goes right here okay and push it inside this end we'll go to the pc okay so this is what we're going to do okay if you have any paper jam right here open up this section and look for any paper jam or or debris this is where to check for any paper jam or debris okay and close this okay i'm going to turn this print around okay right now what I want us to do okay, is to so the paper tray is loaded with A4 paper. Okay, if you check my video, you see how we loaded the A4 paper. You can also remove the cover, okay, and go back in. So you load the particular paper you are using is using a4 b5 a5 various sizes just need to adjust it with the holder okay once you remove the paper a yellow light amber light will flash in the middle just to show you that the paper is not there but right now we just need to push the paper back in okay and go make sure you cover it okay now you can see this blue light is for Wi-Fi network, okay? What I want to show you is, here is the scanner for this printer, okay? Here is the scanner. So you load the particular document you want to scan with the scanner and select the function, okay? So this is the on and off button. This is, button here is to cancel. This is to resume. This is information light. It will ask you to press this information light when you want to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. This is for ID, okay? This is to copy. This button here is for you to increase the number of documents you want or decrease it. Okay, this is LCD screen. And this button here is for Wi-Fi network. Okay, so right now you can see the recession for Wi-Fi is there. What I want us to do is to turn this off, switch off the Wi-Fi. Okay, here we go. You can see the Wi-Fi right now is switch is okay can see the wi-fi is flashing it's no longer connect connected okay and also if you look over here it changed to purple color okay right now it changed to purple color okay so this is the on and off when this light is recession is going up and down it means it's not connected okay right now this is 
is the on and off button switch it on Okay, you can see the Wi-Fi is right now. It's going up and down. Okay, the reception is going. Okay, you can see the Wi-Fi right now is connected. It's right now steady. Okay, but what I want us to do is press on it. Okay. Okay, right now it's disconnected. What I want us to do is to connect this printer to with USB cable. Okay. Now what we need to do is the USB cable, this end, okay, we need to connect it to the PC. Okay, what you need to do is Connect it to your PC, okay, push it inside, here we go, device setting, okay, so right now, right now, you can see, once you connect it, it will show up that device setup, okay, so here is this printer, Okay, so it's recognized straight away. Okay, but what I want, to know, I want us to do is for you to connect this printer. The next thing you need to do is go to Play Store. Okay, if we go to Play Store, Microsoft Store, Right now it's telling us device is, the device is ready, but I want you to look for HP Smart App. HP Smart App. Here we go. Okay, here we go. So launch app. So here is the HP Smart App. Click launch. So the app right now, here is the HP Smart App. It's downloading, okay? So, so HP Smart App is downloading right now. What it's doing right now is downloading HP Smart App, okay? Right now is installing HP Smart App. Here we go. Click on it. Okay. Click launch. Launch. Okay. What is doing right now is launching HP Smart App. Okay. Click allow. Yes. Okay. Now the next thing you need to do is accept all terms and condition. Okay. Now set up a new printer. Okay. Or skip. Click set up a new printer. Right now what is doing right now is looking for this printer. Here we go. It's found. HP Lesser J232 okay slash 237 okay so right now you can re remember this printer is HP Lesser J M234 DW so it's actually M234 slash 237 okay so you select on it 
is found via USB cable port one. Okay, right now it's connect collecting the printer status. So it's getting ready. Okay, now it's asking us find the printer pin. Okay, enter your printer pin. For us, the pin we need to open up right here. Okay, the pin is right here. Okay, so we need to put the pin details. Okay, so what I'm doing right now is the pin number is what I'm putting on. Okay. So what I'm putting doing right now is putting on the pin number. It asks us click submit. So once you put the pin, here we go. Okay, connect printing service, click continue. Okay, so this is HP Plus. Okay, basically you need to register with HP Instant Ink.com. Okay, the benefit of it, like I mentioned, is you get six months trial ink, additional one year HP. So basically giving you two years of free access to advanced scanning features in the HP Smart App, okay? So basically, you gotta click continue or you exit setup, okay? Because this is tutorial, okay? You can click learn more, okay? So if you learn more, you, you give you HP plus overview, HP plus requirement, instant ink, HP Smart Advanced Forest Face Printing, okay? So basically, you can also click back, okay? And also click, if you click continue, then it will ask you to, for you to register, okay? Sign in with HP account or connect your printer to internet, okay? So you can also click confirm. Right now it's launching HP account, okay? Okay, so you type your details, okay? But if you already have an account, okay? This is for you to create an HP account, okay? If you already have an account, what you need to do is sign in, okay? And what I'm doing right now, I'm going to put my details, my email address, Okay, you click next. Okay, what you need to do right now is type in the password. Okay, click sign in. Okay, right now, thanks for your patience. Okay, right now asking you welcome to HP Plus. Okay, load your free toner. Okay, right now if you if you want to load enroll instant ink, then you click continue. Okay, skip toner benefit. Okay, and yes, skip. Okay, slide the paper tray, slide the tray cover into place over the, slide the tray cover into place over the loaded paper, which this is done already. Okay, click next. Okay, click next. OK, 
Okay, click continue. Okay, so you can send link, okay, to orders or skip sending link, skip sending link. Right now, the setup, okay, launch drive, launch drive to print, okay, print and scan or click. Install drive to print, okay. Select print and add print, okay. Click continue. Right now, it's finding this print. So it's finding the print. Okay. Here we go. HP Laser Jet is ready. Okay. So right now this printer is ready. Okay. So you can do a lot of stuff. You can scan, print. Okay. This is HP Laser Jet. Okay. Right now, this printer is connected. Okay. This is how to connect this printer. Okay. And this is how to connect it via USB cable connection. If you're happy with this tutorial, please do consider to subscribe. Okay. Thank you. I'm going to show you how to scan the document on my next video. Thank you.